bump, I'm a hump on a bump, Jack and Jill up a hill, baby trying to get a meal. Yo guys, what's up? Omega back with another video or whatever you want to call it. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you do leave a like and don't subscribe. I appreciate it a lot. And if you are wondering, this video is for entertainment purposes. I am not claiming to be the best player in the world or anything. So I hope you do enjoy and I hope these settings help you in some way. Alrighty then, first off, we have General. Now, General is very simple, you know, it's not really much to say, but if you do want to know, I suggest having your actual display info off because that makes you lag a bit more. Now, I leave mine on because I have pretty good internet most of the time, and it doesn't really bother me that much. Next off, we have audio, you know, keep your music low, uh, keep the mass volume high, sound effects pretty high. I have it in night mode because night mode actually makes it so you can see way better and you can hear the enemies better. You can hear the footsteps a lot more. Voice chat to the max. Video, I have my brightness down to 70%, so it's not too bright, it doesn't hurt my eyes, but it's not too dark so that I can't see an enemy in the corner, you know what I'm saying? V-Sync is off for Terrorist Hunt, so this way it's not really frame dropping or anything like that, and Terrorist Hunt is a good practice. Version disabled, vibration enabled, vertical sensitivity 53, horizontal sensitivity 83. Now, I would suggest starting at 83 at the beginning, I would suggest either going up from 50 to 60 and then going up by 10. This way it's stable and you know, you don't move in too fast. Left stick dead zone 5, right stick dead zone 5 as well. This way you can look from left and right easily, you know, no, no delay. Uh, control rotation classic, aim assist disabled for terrorist ton obvious obvious reasons. Aim down sights is 63, and you can move your way up if you want. But right now I keep it at 63, so you know it's fair, it's easy, stable enough. Gadget deployment advanced, drone deployment advanced, and that is basically it. Now all these settings will be in the description. Not all of them actually. Uh, the only ones that matter the most, like, you know, sensitivity, aim and sensitivity, and, uh, gadget deployment, stuff like that. But if this did help you, I hope you guys do appreciate it, and, uh, please do leave a like, subscribe, turn on notifications. Next video will be up next week, Sunday. I don't know when this video is going up, but it's going up at some point. <laughs> so yeah, peace out guys, and see you in the next video.